Hi everyone, welcome back to Lifestyle Love. For this video today, I've got someone very exciting I want you to meet. This is Carly from The Kids Post and her Facebook group is called Mum's The Word. Now Carly started up an amazing group initially on Facebook and it was a way of connect for mothers to connect with other mothers for support, for ideas, um, for solutions, um, just, you know, I guess to bounce different ideas yeah. off. Um, to vent. vent. <laughs> venting is so important. Um, and, um, you know, from that amazing things have grown and she started the Kids Post and um, the Kids Post has a, a YouTube channel as well. And it's all about helping mums and, um, and getting, helping make life easier, helping feel supported, uplifted, inspired, um, helping you feel sane. Yeah, <laughs> you know, trying to show that you're not alone, basically. Yeah. Um, and, the, and the beautiful thing was actually developed, for, like you came up with the idea from a friend that was, she was French? She was, she's French mm -hmm. and she was pregnant and my little one was a, well, nearly two. And she has no family and very little friends here. And I thought, what do, like, I have mum, stepmom, mm. girlfriends, uh, class friends, all sorts mm. of things. And I thought, what do mums like that do? Do, yeah. Because um, it can be quite lonely being a mother as well if you don't have people, you know, to support you. And as amazing as men are in our lives, they don't quite get, get it. it. Get it. Like, and even in the level, pregnancy yeah. phase, mm. I thought, well, who is she asking those questions that we all sit and ask each other or phone yeah. each other? Um, so she was one of the reasons mm. I started the group and also a lot of people at that time were posting status updates on Facebook and you know on Facebook you have ex-colleagues that you're friends with, mm. ex-boyfriends might yeah. be your friends with, your parents' friends are on Facebook and I thought I really don't want to be posting about uh, breastfeeding questions mm. or yeah. toilet training issues mm. on Facebook for everybody to see and I thought well everyone's on Facebook anyway mm. let's set up a place where it's just mums and we can all just help each other and no mm. one else can see it mm. little did I know <laughs> yeah. that um, this was an original idea I thought mm. at the time it was but it isn't and there are wonderful Facebook groups all mm. over Australia for yeah. mums so ours is mums the word Oz but mm. yeah that's those are the reasons I started it and yeah. it just kind of grew organically on its own. Well, you've got over 11,000 members and it's a closed group, which is yeah. incredible. Um, and it's, I think it's so powerful and, and gorgeous to be able to support each other and, um, and connect with each other. And, and you know, I, for me, I know there's um, so much comfort in that, you know. Look, it, it definitely is a big help. I um, never anticipate, anticipated it would become what it is but the stories that I've been told and the feedback that we've been given of, of situations especially when we're in a time where postnatal depression is thriving unfortunately mm. and mums are feeling very alone and also we're in a time where we're, we're juggling work most of us are working as well mm. so we place in vulnerable know. positions on a regular basis. It's tough. Mm. It's a tough gig. Mm. Not just the parenting gig, but the parenting with work and running the household. And your relationships and yeah. friendships and, and your health, you know. Yeah, it's, it's true. Mm. So it's been great with that. And we've also had some interesting things. I'll just tell you one funny story. There was a mum who was on holiday in Thailand and another mum in the group posted a picture of a dog that was lost in a suburb in Sydney and the mum on holiday in Thailand went hey that's my dog oh my god <laughs> yeah. wow. and so she went I'll go and contact the people that were looking after the dog and we, we quickly through the group managed to um to get so the get dog back home, home. home. Yeah. Like so it, it mm. works in mysterious and wonderful yeah. ways but it's um Perhaps yeah it's been a good yeah, yeah. okay well, tell me about your YouTube channel and what it's all about and um, and how it helps people. Because I love anything that's going to save you time. To yeah, okay. see so I am a big one with all about saving time. Mm. We're just really crappy in the morning mm. in my house. We are <laughs> slow. It doesn't matter what time we get up. Mm. Somehow it's just a battle in the morning. So what I discovered with as a mom, often I don't have time to read loads and loads of um, articles all the time. Sometimes mm. they're great, but often I don't have the time. And Just tell me quickly. Yeah, quickly. <laughs> like, so the reason I started the YouTube channel was sometimes it's easier to visually watch an answer mm. to a question than read it. Yeah. Often we like to see what other mums are doing too. Mm. Um, you know, how to wrap a baby. There's lots of different ways. So mm. let's show those different ways. Mm. Another mum, when I remember when Sky Zone opened, there were all these mums in the group saying, has anyone been there? Is it good for three-year-olds or five-year-olds? What's it like? 
I wanted to create a channel where we would go there and show you mm -hmm. so you can visually see some of these yeah. places and also to put a face to mm -hmm. into, for like yourself yeah. put a face to um, people we see or read about mm. um, that we want to know more about yeah. um, and really just to create quick snippets of useful information we talked with um, Bondo Vets Dr. Lisa on quick things about puppies and kids and I had a dentist about you know mums often asked in my group when should you start brushing your baby's teeth or should you be using a toothbrush mm -hmm. so I got okay well let's quick quickly yep. interview a dentist yep. and get some questions answered from him mm -hmm. so we did that and we interviewed the baby sleep whisperer because sleep would be <laughs> The biggest issue yep. for mums, I think, yep. around the world. So yep. it still is an issue, and I've got almost a three-year-old. <laughs> I think it's fantastic, and you know, lots of information is going to help make a difference and help Thank make you. life easier. And I know it's a cliche, but it does take a village to raise a child. It does. It and there's, you know, everyone has their different strengths, and if we put all our strengths and knowledge together. You know, what an amazing you know child or community of children we're going to yeah. raise and we can all mm. lift each other up I think exactly. that's um, really important for women is to help each other out and not be so competitive mm -hmm. now I want to ask you because time management and efficiency is a big thing on my channel uh, my subscribers are always asking you know for ideas or solutions or tips as to how to make their days run as smoothly yeah. as possible particularly mothers so I would like to hear your sure. top five uh, time efficiency <laughs> tips. <laughs> My first one would be, and mm -hmm. this is not endorsed, <laughs> but I am absolutely obsessed with this product. This mm -hmm. is called IT Cosmetic CC Cream. I my makeup routine went out the window when I had a kid. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> um, I was like, there's no time. This is a foundation, an SPF in one plus it's like got all good things mm -hmm. for your skin so you're actually wearing makeup that's good for your skin okay great and the coverage is good okay. I love it mm -hmm. and what I do is I'll put it in my hand I go like this after I've washed my face and cleansed mm -hmm. and I get in the car and then in the car I throw in some blush a bit of lip stuff mm -hmm. if I've got mm -hmm. and if I can mascara and yep. that's it that's it, you're done. That's it. Yep. so this every day so that's like like almost like a so a sunscreen a concealer, a foundation. It's awesome. Yeah, I, I yeah. am obsessed with this product. Okay. So that's my time saving massive beauty tip. The okay. other one is keratin hair straightening. Okay. This is a big thing for mums because especially when your kids are young, like showering and washing your hair, awesome. <laughs> Getting it dry, good luck. I, so yeah. the mm. keratin is, a, is seriously a massive time saver because really? it gives you a couple of months where it doesn't, it doesn't have to be dead straight, but it means you can actually get out the house in the morning on the school run and mm -hmm. you don't have to wear a baseball cap because okay. your hair can still look decent. Mm -hmm. So the keratin straightening, I recommend, they are they do it now without the formaldehyde and all the bad stuff. Mm -hmm. um, it's definitely a time saver in the first few years of having a child. I absolutely recommend okay. getting that done. Also summer frizz, it's yeah. all good. Mm -hmm. The And I'm not endorsing this, mm -hmm. but the other huge time saver and it changed my life is mm -hmm. The Nutribullet. Okay, yes. Smoothies. Mm. I have a very, very slow eating child mm -hmm. and breakfast is a battle if we need mm. to be somewhere. So I have um, a go-to smoothie, mm -hmm. which I did put um, on the website. Mm -hmm. It's in the Nutribullet and I love the Nutribullet because there's no cleaning like with blenders. It's, yeah. it's so easy. So I use banana or berries. Mm -hmm. I keep frozen berries in the freezer. Mm. Yep, I do the same. <laughs> I throw in... Um, so the banana berries, I put in some coconut water, mm -hmm. some yogurt, and milk, so A2 milk or almond milk, and a bit of plain, plain protein powder so he doesn't even know it's in there. Yep. Or you don't have to use the protein powder. That's a great idea. Um, I'll tell you why this is awesome. This is eucalyptus spray, which kills germs. What I use this for, mm. two major things I use this for. When your little one gets sick, which they often do, mm. at night when they're sleeping, um, even if they're past being sick with a cold, the kids are snotty for the first three years, mm. generally. Yeah. So, in between changing the sheets, I was once he's gone off to, to daycare or school or whatever, I spray this all over the bed and mm. pillow, mm -hmm. and it kills the germs. I oh. also spray this on all the toys, mm -hmm. often, especially the toys that you can't necessarily wash yep. or you don't. So the you reason it comes is time. Wipe down all the time. You don't yeah. have time, and you know the toys get smaller and finickier, and then it's just ah. Uh, so often, if there's been someone with a cold in the house, mm. <laughs> you'll see me yeah. walking around the house spraying this around. But it, it and in the car too, mm. on the car seat, I yep. spray it on the car seat mm. when I've had other people's 
children in the car and mm -hmm. you know the kids have made a mess or one of them's not, again a bit not looking so well yeah not mm. so special i will spray this yes. okay. so this is a, to me it's a great time saver okay great um, so we, and so your final tip for time efficiency management okay so my final tip and i've never discussed this publicly but <laughs> here goes it's a great quick healthy dinner for your child mm -hmm. So I take two minute noodles mm -hmm. and they are whole grain ones now. So I do that, but I don't use the sachet that they come in. I use a miso sachet. So I get the two minute noodles, put miso soup in, two minutes done. But what I also do with it is on the side, I will use, instead of going to the fish shop, buying a piece of salmon, grilling the salmon, I will go and buy the hot smoked salmon. Have you seen that? So it's not flat smoked salmon. It's this hot smoked vacuum packed salmon. Oh yes, yeah, vacuum, yep. Yeah. Mm. So I break that up into pieces on the plate. Mm. So he's getting fish, omega mm. threes, yeah. it's all good. So important. Plus tomatoes, carrots, avocados, cucumbers on the plate, and the miso noodle soup on the side. Oh and that God. dinner literally takes two minutes, 30 seconds to make mm. up. I would even eat that for dinner. <laughs> well, I have, yeah. I have. So guys, if you have any tips that you think will help us um, as, as busy yeah. working moms in helping our days go by more smoothly and efficiently, please put them in the comments box below. Um, also make sure you check out Carly's um, website, The Kids Post, um, her YouTube channel, and um, have a look at the Facebook group. Can they have yeah, yep. if you're a mum or mum to be, um, you head on over to Mum's the Word Oz. That's A U S on Facebook. Okay, so I'll make sure I include all the links below in the description box. Make sure you check it out. Um, if you haven't um, already, please subscribe to this channel and definitely subscribe to um, Carly's channel as well. And I will see you next week on Lifestyle Love or Money Monday. Ciao. Bye. <laughs>